everybody, welcome to another episode of Cooking with Kane. Today we've got a salmon stir fry. Here is your ingredients list and here's a look at them. Don't worry if you haven't got everything there, you can use whatever veggies you want. So, the salmon. This is the first thing that we're going to prepare. I'm just cutting off two identical pieces of foil. I place a baking tray underneath of one piece of the foil. I lay the salmon in the middle. Add a little bit of lemon juice. A little bit of chilli powder. Pop the other piece of foil on top. And then wrap it up like a little parcel. it into our oven. You're going to need a minimum of 20 minutes on gas mark 5 but make sure it's thoroughly cooked before serving. At this point put a pan of water on the boil as well. You're going to need it for our noodles later. Okay I'm going to start off by shredding my cabbage. I'm going to make it quite thin because we need it to cook through quite fast. Onto the mushrooms we're just going to slice them. my carrot, take the top, take the tail off, gonna peel the skin away and then I've got a little tool that makes it a little julienne cut. You can use your knife to get the desired effect as well. Onto my peppers, gonna take off the stalks, gonna take out those pesky membranes and then I'm just gonna slice them into strips today. My yellow pepper. So onto the broccoli, gonna make nice bite-sized pieces. Keep checking as you're cutting your broccoli, I'll find a little brown bit. Toss that aside, we don't need that. Onto the spring onions, we need to cut the roots off. Then about an inch of the top green bits. We're gonna make some diagonal cuts here. We want to do that all the way up the onion. Take off any bad skin if you can see it. Okay, pan of water is coming up to the boil. I've got two tablespoons of sesame oil in my wok. It is smoking hot. You need to be really careful, but we need it to be that hot in order to cook the vegetables really quickly. In with the cabbage, carrots, peppers, mushrooms, and we're going to save the broccoli and the spring onions until last. So once we've got all those veggies in the wok, we're going to give it a nice stir. And after about a minute of coating all those veggies with the oil, we're going to add the broccoli. And at this point, I'm also going to add a little bit of extra flavour. I'm going to put some soy sauce in, light or dark, it's totally up to you. I'm going to add a little bit of ginger paste. And I'm going to put some lemon juice in there. Then I'm going to stir that up, get everything coated in those flavours we've just added. Okay, so we're about three or four minutes in to putting our veggies in the wok and we need to think about putting our noodles in. So get two nests of noodles, maybe more if you're cooking for more people. We want to put the nests of noodles into our boiling water. We're going to give it a couple of minutes for it to break down and then we're going to use our fork to separate all the noodles. I'm just cutting the top of my stir fry pack so it's ready to use a little bit later on. See my noodles came up to the boil so I can break them down with my fork now. So keep checking the noodles, they're going to need about 5 minutes in total. You can try a few at the end to see if they're ready. So now we're ready for the stir fry sauce. 
gonna pop that in, and you guessed it, we're gonna stir that up real good. Oh, I might add a handful of peanuts. You can leave those out if you don't like them. So mix that up, make sure all the veggies are coated in that lovely sauce. Now I'm going in with my spring onions, they don't need long. Stir your noodles, back to your veggies, stir all those onions in. And now I need to think about checking some noodles, see if they're thoroughly cooked. If they're a little bit hard, continue cooking them for a little while. We're going to need to take some out of the pan and give them a taste. Veggies are nearly done, the noodles are done, we need to think about dressing them. So sometimes these noodles are a little bit bland, so we're going to put them back in our pan after we've drained them. We're going to put some sesame oil on them, a little bit of soy sauce and a nice sprinkle of black pepper. Stir that up and we're ready to serve. So to serve, we need to think about a bed of noodles, Put your stir-fried veggies on top, and then on top with your salmon. Hope you enjoyed that episode of Cookie with Kane. Sorry there's no video message again. My webcam is still a little bit broken. So I hope you had fun making everything. It's really rewarding. Everything is pretty much from scratch. You need to be careful when working with a very hot wok, and those knife skills getting everything quite thin. So be careful and ask for help if you need it. Anyway, like always, hope you're staying safe, stay active, and until next time, see you later.